on in and have some fun. So just come in and learn with us with the mouse in the house. Hi guys, my name is Max. Welcome to my lab. Today, we're going to make a matchstick boat by using the surface tension reducing properties of soap. For this experiment, you will need matches, a bar of soap, and water in a large flat bowl. You can also try this in the bath. Let's begin! Ask your parents to cut a slight notch into the back of the match. Take a thin slice of soap and put it into the notch on the match. Pour some water into a large dish and carefully place the boat onto the water. See how it moves. Wow! Your own boat using only a matchstick. What's in the soap that makes it move? The soap molecules break down the surface tension of the water, creating current at the back of the match, which acts like an engine propelling it forward. Can you use any soap? Yes, but some soaps work better than others. Try using liquid soap. Wow, look at that! Now let someone else try. Remember, you need to replace the water each time you try this as the boat will move until the water's surface is covered with a layer of soap. Dip the matchstick into the liquid soap and carefully place it onto the water. Watch it go! So now you can turn a simple match into a moving boat. Imagine your matchstick boat is cruising down a river. This same principle helps when you're washing the dishes. Water and grease do not mix. But when you add the soap, it allows the grease to dissolve in the water and you can rinse away dirt under the tap. <laughs> Twist and tangle up your own mouth with tongue twisters today. Six thick thistle sticks. Six thick thistle sticks. Give some of these fun science experiments a try. Bye for now and happy experimenting.